Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. And what we have here, we take the log on both sides. That is, we have log 5 raised to the power x equals to log 500 from here. Then, next step, apply the power log logarithm. What we have log m raised to the power p is same thing as p log m. That is what we have here becomes x log 5 equals to log 500 from here. The next step divide both sides by log 5. That is, divide this side by log 5. Also, divide this side by log 5, which implies a log 5 cancelled each other here. Yeah? We have x equals to log. 500 over log 5. And from here, 500 can be written as 5 times 100, which implies what we have becomes x equals to log 5 times 100 over log 5. And this follows when we have log a times b. Which can be written as log a plus log b. At this here we have x equals to log 5 plus log 100 over log 5. Then we separate this into two fractions and this becomes x equals to log 5 over log. 5 plus log 100 over log 5. Now this log 5 cancelled each other here. This becomes x equals to 1 plus log 100 over log 5. Then, next step here, we can write 100 as 5 times 20. And what we have becomes x equals to 1 plus log 5 times 20 over log 5. This, this also follows the law of logarithm and becomes x equals to 1 plus log 5 plus log 20 over log 5. That is... We separate this into two fractions and this becomes x equals to 1 plus log 5 over log 5 plus log 20 over log 5. That this here, log 5 cancel each other. We have one less here, which implies x equals to 1 plus 1, that's 2, and plus log 20 over log 5 and next step here also 20 can be written as 5 times 4 which implies here we have x equals to 2 plus log 5 times 4 over log 5 that is this also follows the law of logarithm and we have x equals to 2 plus log 5 plus log 4 over log 5. That is, we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to 2 plus log 5 over log 5 plus log 4 over log 5. Then, also here, log 5 cancel each other. We have one left. And this becomes x equals to 2 plus 1. That's 3. And plus log 4 over log 5. And from here, we can express 4 as 2 times 2. That's 2 squared. And what we have becomes x equals to 3 plus log 2 squared over log 5. That is, we apply the power of logarithm. 
2 comes here. This becomes x equals to 3 plus 2 log 2 over log 5. That is, we apply change of base a when we have log a over log b, which is the same thing as log a to base b. And this here we have x equals to 3 plus 2 log 2 base 5. That is the value of x here we have. x equals to 3 plus 2 log 2 base 5. Let's check here. If this satisfies this given problem, that is, we substitute the value of x here, which is x equals to 3 plus 2 log 2 base 5. And what we have here becomes 5 raised to power 3 plus 2 log 2 base 5. Is it equals to 500 on this side? Then, again, we apply log indices. A raised to power n plus n, same thing as. A is to power him times a is to power him. At this year, what we have becomes 5 raised to power 3 times 5 raised to power 2 log 2 base 5. This is equals to 500 on this side. And 5 raised to power 3, 5 multiply itself 3 times as 125 and times here. We reverse this 2 from power log. We have 5 raised to power log 2 squared base 5. Is it equals to 500 on this side? Then we have 125 times 5 raised to power log 2 squared as 4 is 5. Is it equals to 500 on this side? Then, yeah, this follows when we have a raised to power log b to base a, which is equals to b. This becomes 125 times 4. This is equals to 500 on this side. And of course, 125 times 4, yeah, when we multiply, yeah, we have 4 times 5, that's 20, carry 2, yeah, right 0, we have 8, 4 times 2, 8 plus 2, 10, carry 1, 4 times 1, 4 plus that one, 500. So yeah, we have 500 equals to 500 from here. That is left hand side is equal to the right hand side, and therefore we conclude that x equals to 3 plus 2 log 2 base 5 satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell on. Share this video, give it a thumbs up, put your comments. See you next class, and bye for now.